everybody welcome back to the channel um, this is day number three of my tag series I'm sorry about my voice I'm really not well I wasn't going to come on and do one tonight but I thought I would just pop in and do one anyway so I'm just going to keep it quite simple tonight I've cut myself out from my template my large tag and I'm just going to punch my hole here get it in. There we are. So I've just punched my hole and I would like to say to everybody happy Halloween. I hope everybody's having a fantastic time. My son is out trick-or-treating just now. My grandkids were down earlier. Um, so yeah, um, I hope everybody has a fantastic night and doesn't get too scared. <laughs> so um, getting back to this wee tag. So the first thing I'm going to do now is take one of these wee doilies. Um, these are quite small doilies. I got these from AliExpress a while back. So they're, they're not the biggest, but they're the smallest. So I'm going to pop one on here. Sort of half a wee bit off the edge. I'm just going to use my wet glue. So, what has everybody been up to for Halloween? Have you been out guising with your kids or have you been at Halloween parties? Let me know. I'd love to know what you've all been up to. I think definitely the Halloween's getting bigger in this country now. Um, and we're definitely in crafting, it's getting bigger. Which is a good thing because it gives the kids things to do. So. Okay, so I've just popped that doily on there and I'm going to cut off the excess on the back. So you can see that, I don't know if it shows up very well. And then the next thing I'm going to do is put on some of this, I've picked out this washi. It's like the sort of bronzy with the black brock. So, oops, put some glue on that there, I'll just wipe that off. Get this open. I really apologise for my throat, and um, folks, my throat is killing me. My ears are sore, and I actually had to stay off placement today because obviously I don't want to give it to the staff or the elderly service users. So I had to take the day off today. So I missed the Halloween party, which was rubbish, but wasn't worth risking making anybody ill. So yeah, I had to take the day off. I think I'll probably have to take tomorrow off as well, which isn't so good because I really need to build my days up, but I can't go in and spread it about like I said, so needs must. So I popped this one on and I'm then I've picked out this one as well. It's just like a, a gold script, like a bronzy script. You can't really make out what it says. I think um, you're not meant to, it's just for decorative purposes. Um, yeah, it's just a wee decorative one, so I'm just going to pop a strip of that along the bottom and take the excess off. So it's been quite a long day today, I've just I've, I've been in bed all day, just trying to rest so that I can feel a bit better. Um, I hate being no well. I'm the world's worst patient. I really hate being no well. So I've popped on these two washies on the bottom now. It's my doily. And then what I'm going to do is I've got these stamps that I got a while ago. They were from a magazine, just went a freebie from a magazine. And I like this wee one here that's in the mason jar. So I'm just going to stamp this out. I've never used these before and I've had them for a few years, so see what they're like. I'll just grab a stamping block and some ink. That one's a wee bit small. I'll just grab a bigger stamping block. Okay, so we'll pop this on the stamping block and I'm just going to use some black ink because we've got the black in the washi tape. I'm just going to ink it up. 
really don't know what this is going to turn out like, as I say, because I haven't used this before. But hopefully it'll be okay. And then I'm just going to stamp it in the middle of my doily and see what it comes out like. Okay, that's actually came out quite nice. You can see there. I'll just stamp that out. It looks quite cute. Yeah, I like it. It's nice. And then I have um, this pen. You can see it's from Paper Mania, Do Crafts Paper Mania, and it's one of their fluid metallic brush markers, and it's like a sort of bronzy greeny sort of colour. And I'm just going to go into the flowers and pop a wee bit of colour just on some of the petals, not everywhere, just a wee bit, just to match it in with the washi. So a wee bit on the edge of the petal and just sorry if you can't see what I'm doing, I keep forgetting that I've got to stay in shot. Just adding some around and on some of the stalks that are in the water. Yeah. So it's just added a wee bit of colour. I'm gonna add a wee bit of glue on the end of this doily because it's not sticking that well. Pop that down there. So that's this one. And then I've got um these stamps. I can't even remember where I got these. I think these were from Hobbycraft Paula Pascal stamps. And they just have got lots of different sentiments on them. So I'm gonna use the thank you one. It's like a thank you script writing. Um, so I'll grab that smaller block and I'm just going to put that down there and pop on some black ink again. Let me see how this stamps out. I've not used this one before. So I'm going to put it here. And that just came out like so. Thank you. And then I've got this metal charm that I had in my stash, I can't even remember where I got it from but I'm going to add that up here or maybe here mm. yeah I'm going to add it down there so I'm just going to get my hot glue gun just pop this glue on make sure that it sticks well so I'm going to put it down here There, just let that dry for a second before I hold it up. And then I think I'm going to lastly just pop it on mm, yeah, two of these wee sort of button embellishments. I'll show you that in a second. These, I know it's not a very um, complicated tag tonight or very embellished but like I say I'm not feeling that great so I just thought I would pop on and do a wee quick one because I didn't want to interrupt my seven day series so I just thought I would roll myself out of bed and come on and do this quickly so so far this is oops this is what we've got Get the glue off, extra glue flying about. We've got the metal embellishment, the doily, thank you, and the wee buttons. I've got extra glue flying about here from the glue gun. And I think I'm going to try <laughs> and go around the edge with this brush marker just to add in some like to frame it kind of just need to be careful that I don't slip and I have done that before where I've slipped and then just had to cover it up with, <laughs> with an embellishment or something and make it look like it's supposed to be there which I'm sure we've all done 
like you always say on creating craft, if in doubt, stick a butterfly on it. Which again, I have done. So, just colouring in right the way around the edge. To frame it. I don't know if you can see that, it just makes it stand out a wee bit better. And I think that is about us for this one. Mm, maybe, what am I like, I'm never happy. I think maybe I need, because the thank you looks like it's just sitting there on its own. I think I'm going to try and put see what it looks like anyway, if I can find the end of it. Try and put a wee bit washy from here to here. Yeah, I'm going to go with that. You see what I mean? I just kind of want to wing it and see what works. <laughs> But yeah, I do like that, so I'm just going to cut that off like that. I felt like it just needed something just to finish it off because it still looked a wee bit plain. And I'm not very good at doing plain, to be honest. I feel like I don't like a lot of blank space. Yeah, it's quite nice like that. I quite like that. Let's take off that extra glue. Yeah, so there we go. There is the finished tag. This one's got a kind of florally theme, so it's pretty plain, but I think it's quite it's quite a classy one, it's quite classy looking. Um, I suppose you could give this as a thank you, maybe for if you've received a wedding gift or an anniversary gift, because it's really quite an elegant one actually. So yeah, that is number three in my seven day tag series. I hope you like it, everyone. As I say, sorry it's not a very long um, process video tonight. <clears throat> I just really don't feel well. But I hope you still enjoyed it. I hope this has given you a wee bit of inspiration. And I will see you all again tomorrow. Have a fantastic Halloween, everybody. And thank you to all my new subscribers. I've got quite a few today and all my existing subscribers. And I will see you guys all again tomorrow. Bye-bye. Take care.